Well, I shot a, what was it, an eight pointer? We decided it was an eight pointer uh, today. And Justin shot an eight pointer. Both of them were kind of small, but hey, we'll take what we can get. And he also shot a doe. Is that a doe or a button buck? Button. It's a button buck. It just looks very, it's a very puny deer. It's like a goat. He shot a goat. Um, but yeah, good luck today. He got two, I got one. Um, hunting. Shotgun season, 2010. In Illinois. So yeah. I sweet. love them all. All right. All right, TR, just introduce us briefly to what's going on here. Well, we got a bunch of guns in the back of our truck, a bunch of knives, and all right. a bunch of deer. Okay, show me the deer. Okay, we got a deer. Come here, come here. All right, dude, I'll, I'll zoom in. He's got a stick in his mouth. This is just hold on to that. For dear life. You need to bend down because I can't get you For in. For dear there. death. <laughs> He's holding on to this stick for dear death. He's not letting go of it. All right. <laughs> well, we all. Okay, um, there's Justin's deer right there. Not a, not a bad spread. It'll look nice European mounted. I think we should have both waited like two or three years before we shot our bucks. Hey, um, Justin, you want to tell a little bit about your, a little bit about your hunt today? I was just out walking around. He was walking around too, and so. Why were you out walking around? How are you in your deer stand? I got a little bit tired. Yeah. Sitting around. A little bored. <laughs> yeah. I actually, I was actually out walking around. He called me. He's like, I shot one. So I got out and I kind of walked around a little bit too. And then I got bored of walking around and I decided to sit. There's a spot where the wind was coming over this hill. But I got down underneath the hill. So the wind is kind of going behind my face. So it's kind of like not in the wind. So my scent was going down. But um, there was a lot of deer movement, a lot of tracks going around that hill that I was at. And it was kind of overlooking this like clearing like you know spotted the trees and there's a lot of activity there so I just kind of sat there uh, it wasn't an hour after I decided to sit on that spot that this guy comes walking up on me and uh, I shot uh, I shot him actually through a little sapling um, the, the slug went through a sapling and then uh, lung him. anyway he died uh, Um, yeah, all of our deer pretty much died with no complications, found them pretty easy. My deer is probably about 200 pounds, field dressed. Uh, he's got, he's pretty hefty. Uh, we haven't weighed, we haven't weighed him, but I, I bet this one's about 200 pounds. Full rut. He's got that thick neck. Look at that neck. Massive. Uh, so good, good season, and um, he'll be out with his muzzleloader next weekend, and I'll be out with the bow. So hopefully we'll have good luck next weekend too. Um, hopefully we won't hit any with the truck, and if we do, hopefully we'll, you know, kill it. Anyway, all right. Here we are at the mall. All right, hey, what? Hey, close it up because there's a security guard that's coming around here. Well, this has been a Trent Rumpa outdoor adventure. Deer season 2010. Uh, with uh, bullets and slugs. And a deer. <laughs>